Hello. Thank you for joining me in my workshop, Beautiful Nature, today. Um, today I'm going to talk to you guys about Aroma Touch, this oil right here. Aroma Touch is really cool. I have not used it a lot in the past, but after doing all the research I did on it, I am going to be using it a lot more. I can tell you that much. So, real quickly, the price of Aroma Touch for a this is a 5 mil bottle, that's the one I have, but 15 mil bottle, such as this one right here. The price for Aroma Touch is 20, $26 wholesale through doTERRA, and it is $34.67 at the retail price. It is certified pure therapeutic grade, 100% oil, and it has some amazing constituents. So this is a blend that doTERRA makes specifically for massages. They call it the oil of relaxation and it is there to provi provide feelings of relief and it's there to relieve um, any feelings of anxiety or feelings of stress or bodily feelings of stress. So this is an awesome oil if you are stuck in any places, if you feel stuck. If you love to get massages, this is a great way to get even more out of your massages. Um, many people use it just by having a drop or two in their hand and massaging it into your hand, or using a carrier oil such as coconut oil or almond oil to um, dilute it, and then you can spread it all throughout your hand or throughout your back and your body during a massage. This oil smells great. I have been using it today and it feels really good, smells really good, and it brings up a lot of different memories for me, which is interesting, memories of pleasure. So it really allows pleasure into our lives. So the constituents of this oil are basil, cypress, grapefruit, lavender, marjoram, and pepper. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about why that makes this such why that makes Aroma Touch such a powerful oil. So basil is the oil of renewal. Basil is great for cooking. Um, it has many antimicrobial, antibacterial properties, and so it's great for our immune system and cleaning our body, our body out. Um, basil is not recommended for people who are pregnant or nursing. Um, I read in a few different places that basil is supposed to be good for stimulating um, milk, but at the same time other places said it is not good for um, pregnant women. So if you are pregnant or nursing, then consult a physician before using it. Well, and before using Aroma Touch. Although I read that Aroma Touch is safe for pregnancy, just consult your physician or doctor to be sure so nothing bad happens. So basil is an awesome spice and it's great for um, helping us flow and move through places we're stuck in or if we're if we get nervous through lots of movement such as in a car and things like that or on, a, on an airplane, basil is really good for um, helping us to stand in that position and relieve those anxieties or feelings of um, anything negative going through your body. So cypress. Cypress is the oil of motion and flow. That is a label given to it by the emotional emotions and essential oil book and cypress is really cool it's a tree and they use the bark of it and reading about it it has many different benefits um, many benefits that it's good for your blood good for your digestion good for um, aiding different parts of your body to do what it's supposed to so it's great that this is in the emotional blend because it's the oil of movement and flow. 
So it's good for helping us move through places we're stuck in, and that's especially good during massages because they're helping massage any negative um, blocks and things out of our body. So cypress is very beneficial towards that. Grapefruit is the oil of honoring the body. Grapefruit is an amazing oil. I love it. Whenever I use it, it gives me like a sparkle in my day. When I smell it, it smells sparkly and shiny. So I really love grapefruit and it's uh, antibacterial. It's great for as an antiseptic. If you have any parts of your body that are damaged, then uh, grapefruit aids in healing and cleansing those areas. Grapefruit is a great cleanser. And it's a great cleaner too around the house if you ever want to use grapefruit for that. Lavender, which I spelled wrong. I spelled it lavender. So lavender is the oil of communication. And lavender is great for things such as burns and rashes. If you have damaged skin, you can put lavender on it and it really works like a miracle. Lav I've heard literal miracle stories from lavender and I have used it myself on burns and things like that and the results that it assists in providing are amazing. So lavender smells great. It's a flower and this gives a really nice flowery body to the aroma touch scent and aroma and it is also great for our body. It's great for your skin. It is great for brightening your skin. Basil is as well. Basil is also really good for giving a sheen and a shine to your skin and your hair. So if you have dull skin or dull hair, then basil aids in providing a sparkle to that as well and a shine to that. Um, I love lavender. It smells great. It's great for relaxing and it's great for sleeping. If you have trouble falling asleep at night, Lavender is great in assisting with that. So Aroma Touch can be used for sleeping as well. And next is marjoram. Marjoram is a spice. And it is known as the oil of connection. So marjoram helps us connect with our bodies and connect with ourselves so that we can do what we need to do. It allows us to connect with the places in ourselves that we don't want to connect with. Uh, lots of people have said that marjoram is great for pain and great for easing pain and it helps us move through situations where we are not ready to move through or where we do not want to move through. So marjoram is beautiful in that way. Um, lots of people use it for pain, like I said, and if you have, it's also an antiseptic and a antibacterial as well. So if you have pains, if you have damaged skin, uh, marjoram is a good one for that, and aroma, aroma touch all around. Um, I'd like to mention too that grapefruit is the oil of honoring the body and it is great for connecting with our body as well. Um, it's great for loving our body how it is and so that we can improve it. If we don't love our body how it is then we never have the energy to shift it or change it away from where it is. So grapefruit is great for letting us see where our body is at and then allowing us to love it where it is and then moving to places where we need to move to from there. It has been said to be really good at diets and many people, dietitians recommend it, but what some people recommend is to take it because it takes away your, um, takes away your need for food and those um, things where you just reach out for food. But what it 
can do is allow us to connect to ourself so that we no longer need to reach out at all. It's not like it take, it's a, it's not a suppressant, but it allows us to open to ourselves so that we don't need to suppress those things. We just know and love and love ourselves and know where to move to, move to from there without needing something else. And another note on grapefruit is it is said that it doesn't, um, it is not um, a bad thing to grapefruit oil is okay to mix with um, certain prescriptions such as relaxants. Um, people say that it is okay. I am not entirely sure on that, but that's what I read. Um, again, consult your physician if you are using relaxants um, with grapefruit because it is um, actual grapefruit juice does not mix with them, but grapefruit oil is said to be okay. Now to peppermint, the oil of a buoyant heart. <clears throat> peppermint is an amazing oil. It's one of my top used oils and I use it as a breath freshener. I use it on my heart to feel better. Um, peppermint is great for connecting us to our hearts and allowing us to really find comfort in situations where it is tough. It's great for masking pain and so like if you have any issues, if your heart hurts or things like that, um, peppermint, you can put peppermint on there and it will sort of cover it up, but you don't want to overuse peppermint as a mask for the pain. There's better oils that will help you bring out the pain. Um, such as marjoram and basil, which will help you move through it rather than masking it. But peppermint is great for just helping you feel better in times where you don't feel so good. So that is Aroma Touch. Again, I would like to tell you guys I am not a certified physician or doctor, so this is not um, actual certified advice, but I have researched this myself, I've grown up around it and used it and have first-hand knowledge with the way a lot of it works and it's amazing stuff. So if you are concerned about issues with it, be sure to consult your doctor or physician and if you have any questions that I might answer for you, questions, concerns, or comments, share them in the comment section below. And thank you for watching. That is Roma Touch right here. Love you guys. Have a good day.